Purple Tiger families, May and its flowers have arrived and brought with it some of the warmth and sunshine we've been looking forward to. The Junior Prom is on the horizon and takes place in two weeks. With prom season approaching, students will attend an assembly the week leading up to prom to address impaired driving, sponsored by Washington County and our local emergency service providers from Hudson Falls and Fort Edward and Kingsbury. Beyond just the prom, it's a good time to remind everyone in our school community to take some extra time and precautions while driving as our students are out and about participating in lots of activities. Let's highlight some students teaching students. This past fall, students from Ms. Gillis's science class and Regents biology class worked on a special project to educate intermediate school students about reducing their impact on the environment. The project, One Little Change, focused on topics such as fast fashion, urban deforestation, and food waste. Students learned how to repurpose old clothing into reusable bags, wrote letters to elected officials, and explored composting with worms. As a part of this project, students who participated in the lighter rating campaign will have the opportunity to receive their very own tree sapling from the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation. Students will be returning to the intermediate school the week of May 6th to distribute these saplings and receive instructions on caring for them over the next five years. The high school hosted both a job fair sponsored by LEAP and a college fair in partnership with CASDA this past week with over 30 colleges and universities in attendance. Our school counselors work very hard to make our students aware of the resources that are available to them. They can assist with scheduling questions, scholarships, college information, financial aid resources, and so much more. Please be sure to have an open line of communication with your student's school counselor. Looking forward, please mark your calendars for the return of the Celebration of the Arts. It will be hosted here at the high school on May 21st from 6 to 8 p.m. The Celebration of the Arts provides a great opportunity to show off our students' talents. You'll see and hear more about that event as it gets closer. Stay safe and have a great weekend.